PB&J and cheap wings. Just because the restaurant I work in offers a peanut butter and jelly sandwich on the kids menu doesn't mean you have to come and order it every time you have less than $3 in your bank account. Why in the hell would a grown ass man come in a restaurant and order a PB&J which he could easily make in the comfort of his own home? I'll tell you why, cause he's broke. But he still wants to go out and eat with all his beer guzzling buddies who also can't tip for shit. Just cause a sandwich only costs a few dollars doesn't mean you should tip any less for a meal that costs nine. Believe it or not, it takes me just as much effort to bring you that PB&J as it does to bring a fried chicken on wheat bread. And while we're at it, I know that on wing night, your total bill only comes out to $4, but on a regular night, that bill would at least be 10. So why can't you tip accordingly? And if you don't know how to do that or can't afford to, why don't you stay the f home and no, I don't know, make yourself a peanut butter and jelly sandwich, you dumb f